Some people was asking me to make an update video on how to mod on Gorilla Tag. So in this video, I'm just going to go through all the steps. I'm going to give you the updated Monkey Mod Manager. I'm going to give you a mod menu that I use. Hopefully, I can help you get mods. First, you're going to need Steam and Gorilla Tag. You can also do the Oculus app, but it sucks. I recommend just getting it on Steam. Even if you have Gorilla Tag on your Oculus headset and you bought it for free on there, you still have to pay $20. They made it not free on PC. But anyways, after you bought Gorilla Tag, make sure you just run Gorilla Tag once before you download Monkey Mod Manager. But that's where we're going to head right now. So I always link my Discord link in the description of the videos. So you go to the description, click the invite link, and then you should find my Discord server. Just make sure you click the green check mark to verify your account. Scroll down until you see how to mod update. Download Monkey Mod Manager, double click it to launch it. Now if you see that it says you can't find the folder path, all you have to do is click OK, and then this little pop-up should pop up. Go to your Steam, right-click Gorilla Tag, Manage, Browse Local Files, and this is going to be your Gorilla Tag folder. So all you have to do is click this little empty space up here, so it will copy it, and then Control C, or you can right-click and click Copy. Now go back to Monkey Mod Manager, do the same thing, click on the empty space, then you can do Control V, or you can right-click and paste it. But after you paste it, click Enter, and then it should pop up this, just double-click on the Gorilla Tag.exe. Now this window should pop up. I'm going to give you a couple mods that you should download. First is Haunted Mod Menu. It's not actually a menu. It's just so you can see all your mods in one place on your hand. And it only works in modded lobbies. But it's very useful. Scroll down until you see Libraries. Download everything except the Banana Hook. Now Computer Interface doesn't work currently. But I have a video on how to fix it. But all you do is click Install Slash Update. And now you have mods. But I'm going to give you a mod menu that works on the new update. And that is pretty good. It is called Shiba GT Dark. God, I really hope Shiba didn't hear me say that. All you have to do is click it and download it. If it says anything about the virus, just continue anyways. Now there's two ways to do the next part. You can go to Monkey Mod Manager, go to Utilities, and then you can go to the Game Folder. And that brings up your Game Folder. But if you want to know how to get to it without Monkey Mod Manager, go to your Steam, right click, Manage, and browse local files. It'll bring up the same exact window. Next, I want you to go into your BepinX folder, and then I want to go to your plugins. Now, this is where all your mods are going to be. You should have these mods and these mods and nothing else. So all I want you to do is drag Shiba Dark into this folder. Now, when you launch up Gorilla Tag, you'll have mods. If you have any issues with this video, go to my Discord at the right account people at my alt account but if you do at jkl it would be this one right here instead of this one i know the name it, it changes a lot so the one with the the p don't do that one 